Hey guys, welcome back to Xamarin guys. So in this tutorial, we are going to play around with image circle without plugin as well as with plugin. So stay tuned for the tutorial. In order to clip any image, we have to first of all place our image inside the drawable folder of Android and the resources folder of iOS. Then our next work is to just clip the image without using the plugin. You can see over here inside our main page which is a starting page and then we have three columns and inside the center of that uh, specific column I have put one image named as home.png over here. Then we are going to place that image inside the grid dot column one and then we can just run it without uh, any hassle. We'll get our circled image as like this. Now our next job is to integrate one plugin so this was basically uh, without the plugin now we are going to integrate one plugin which will be made much more helpful and with lots of features the plugin named is ff image loading that we will be adding so let's go to over here then let's type ff image loading then we'll just select the ff image loading i'll select that and we'll just click on add and then we'll go just select three project that is our shared android and ios project let the project compile and uh, this shared code i'm just going to disable it as of now because we don't need this as we are going to integrate plugin now let's add the component that is required inside the ios platform specific configuration that is this line of code cast image renderer that inherits from ff image loading forms dot platform we are going to save it now uh, well, let's go to our clipping image that is our shared project now we are going to add another plugin that is the inheritance of the uh, ff image loading that is the transformation as this transformation plugin helps us to design or shape the images that is going to be added uh, inside that specific control that is this cast image control and we have this ff image loading transformation which will just say circle the image that is provided with the source so you can see over here we have margin property then we have you can see over here we have the error place holder and we can just put some error place holder images too and putting all the images in the resources folder whenever the image is not getting loaded then this placeholder is going to act and we can add the loading placeholder add some gif animations everything and you can play around with those uh, values as well as property and we have height request with request i am going to down sample the view size to two and along with that we have another platform specific configuration for the android 2 that is this line of code that is case image render uh two okay so this is the uh, platform specific con configuration that inherits from ff image loading then that's all now we can just run our android project and see whether it compiles as well as gives us output or not so i have used xamarin forms 5.0 as of now so i'm uh, getting as actual output for latest uh, fmms loading so it works same as for ios 2 so let's see all right we got our specific output that's all for this tutorial now thank you guys thanks for watching